Hi, I'm Jody with the Mount Baldy Ski Patrol. And today I'm going to show you how to make a fit harness out of a 20 foot length of tubular webbing. So, the first thing you need to do is to find the middle of the webbing. Fold it in half. Here I go, I have the middle of my webbing. I'm going to put it right here on my side because that's where I want to end up at the end to tie my knot. First thing I do is I make a wrap around my hip here to the front and then I'm going to make a twist with one end of the webbing and then I'm going to go ahead and take the other end of the webbing and make another twist. So now I've made two twists here on my webbing. In the end of this, this is where I'm going to connect my carabiner in and I have it nice and firm around my hips. Now the two loose ends, I'm going to stick them down through my leg grab them from the back. Now I'm being very careful here not to pinch my girl parts or my boy parts if you're a boy because that could be really unpleasant. Take your loose end of your harness, your webbing, pull it through like that. Pull the other end through this here. Now at this point I'm going to do kind of a squat thing because I want to tighten up my harness. I'm going to show you the back side here. I have it below my bum and above my hip here. Okay. Next I'm going to take, wrap around my waist again because I want to be good and firmly entrenched in this harness. I'm going to take another wrap around the spot where I want to put my carabiner up. With each end of my harness. Okay. And around I go last time to the side. One thing that you want to make sure is you try not to twist your harness. You try to keep it nice and flat so that you're not sitting on bends and creases because that could be pretty uncomfortable too when you're hanging from a rope. Now I'm going to do a knot and this is, what kind of knot is this Bill? Square knot. Square knot. So to do a square knot I'm going to do right here left over right. Then I'm going to do right over left. Right over left. I want this nice and snug. And there's a way of looking to see by this little design here, which Bill says is some special thing, that you have indeed correctly made your square knot. We'll do another video later on knots. Okay, now with the ends, I want to do a safety. So what I'm going to do here is an overhand knot. Okay, I'm going to go, do I go under all four of them? Or no, do just, I, just the, the one. Okay, to do an overhand knot, I'm going to go under my webbing, all the way over my loop, back through, snug it up, close to my square knot, other loose end, I'm going to do the same thing, under my webbing, all the way over my loop, back through, snug it up, close to my square knot, Tuck the leftover webbing in your pocket. Tuck the leftover webbing in my pocket. Is that right, Bill? Yep. So that I don't get in trouble with it. And there you go. I have a sit harness ready to hook my carabiner on.